introducing to you tennis and pickleball courts in Summerlin. How much more fun do you want? That's what we're talking about. So let's roll. everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor, and today I have... Chris Chapman, buyer's agent for the Angela O'Hare real estate team. And we thought the weather has been beautiful, and Chris is an avid tennis player, I'm a beginner tennis player, and we thought we would go over and educate you guys on all the tennis courts that Summerlin, and pickleball courts that Summerlin has to offer, right? There, there are tons. I love playing <laughs> tennis. I love getting on the court as much as i can in uh the limited free time because we're out showing you guys all the houses this right. spring and summer but uh we definitely like to get out on the court and get some exercise yeah definitely and so it's interesting pickleball's um picking up across it's the nation off. it's it taken, taken off. off do you know what exactly pickleball is can you explain uh, i'll do my best <laughs> so if you kind of understand obviously the premise of tennis and you've played ping pong it's kind of meshing the two right. it's not as big as tennis it's not definitely not as small as a ping pong using a table you're out on a court and they some play singles some play doubles it's a very fast quick moving paced game um i've played it a few times on vacation with a couple of drinks so that's all <laughs> that's always fun but people are getting competitive with it and they're yes. getting leagues and tournaments and it's like sweeping the nation yes and there's actually professionals out there making uh money doing this and most of them have come over from Yes, the, the, the racket is like a paddle, right? Yeah, it's like a table tennis yeah. and paddle, pretty they much. They say like it's a cross between badminton, ping pong, and tennis, and it's like on a tennis court, but half the size half or a lot size, smaller. Much smaller, yeah. yeah. So anyway, folks, we just wanted to go over all the tennis courts and all the pickleball courts that Summerlin has to offer. I'm going to hold my sheet because, you know what, I'm good, but not that good. <laughs> And they're all in alphabetical order, but the number one tennis court is the Arbor's Tennis and Play Park. And how we're going to do this, I'm going to go briefly over these parks, and then we're going to take it to Chris, who did actually went to all of these tennis courts and pickleball courts and uh, showcased these courts. I'll be reporting from the field. He'll be reporting from the field, exactly. So the Arbor's and Tennis and Play Park is kind of like here, the Darling Tennis Center, where it's um, where you can do tennis lessons there. Lessons, There's a pro shop. Appointment only, uh, yeah, exactly. generally speaking. And then the professional director there is Gordon Hammond, and he's been serving as a director since 1999 wow. in the Summerlin area. And the Arbors and Tennis and Play Park has five lighted outdoor courts, including a stadium court. It also has a pro shop and different programs that cater to uh, tennis of all ages. So, um, so we're going to go to Chris now, and he's going to show us what this tennis court looks like. I'll show you around. <laughs> Hi, guys. Chris Chapman here with the Angelo Hare Real Estate Team. We're at the Arbors Tennis and Play Park. This is in the heart of Summerlin. Great park, tons of tennis courts. We're gonna go inside and tell you more about it. So the Arbors is a fantastic facility. Five lit tennis courts. And you can also receive personal instruction. I have pros out here hitting with you all the time. We're gonna go over the Gardens Park and the Gardens Park is located in the Gardens Village. I'm not gonna go over the addresses. I will post a blog link in down in the description below so you can find out exactly where all these parks are. But this is in Summerlin South and they have two lighted tennis courts. So we're gonna have Chris show us that court as well. See you down there by Town Center Boulevard. Yep. Hi guys, checking in here. Chris Chapman from the Angelo O'Hara real estate team wanted to show you a few more of the tennis courts in Summerlin. This is in the heart of Summerlin, right off of Town Square. The Gardens Park. Two tennis courts, play area for the kids, along with huge grass area that has tons of soccer going on all the time in the afternoons and weekends. All right, guys, as mentioned, we have two courts here at Gardens Park. Basketball courts just beyond, and there's only two here, so they fill up very fast. First come, first serve. They're always full in the evenings. 
Next, we have the Hills Park, which is part of the Hills Village in Summerlin North. And this one also has two lighted tennis courts. Hey, my is agent Chris Chapman for the Angelo Hair Real Estate Team. We're here in North Summerlin at the Hills Park. We want to show you these tennis courts. Hills tennis courts. We have two courts here and they are both lit and they're used quite frequently. A lot of lessons go on here as well in the afternoons. Then we have the Mesa Park and that's located in the Mesa Village, located in Summerlin South and they also have two lighted tennis courts. Seems like to be the theme. Most of them just have two lighted tennis two. courts. And the Mesa Park is one of the most beautiful parks. Oh yeah, I love that Mesa Summerland. area. Just gorgeous. Oh, that whole drive from Town Center to Mesa Park Drive. You have the mountains off yep. to the right. It's beautiful. Hey guys, Chris Chapman here, reporting from the beautiful Mesa Park. We have two lit courts. This is one of my favorites. Let me show you why. We have basketball courts. And we're right up against the Mesa backdrop. Then we have Reverence Park, and Reverence Park is located in the Reverence Village in Summerlin West, and they also have two lighted tennis courts. Hey guys, Chris Chapman here, buyer's agent with the Angelo Hair Real Estate Team. Checking in from Reverence, a Summerlin Village. We are going to show you these tennis courts now. In addition to the two lit tennis courts at Reverence, there's ample opportunity for hiking. Gorgeous mountains all around the park. Then we have Ridgebrook Park located in the Ridgebrook Village, part of Summerlin South. Again, two lighted tennis courts. <laughs> Hey guys, we're here at Ridge Book Park showing you more tennis courts. Let's go take a look. So Ridge Brook Park only has one court, just one. It is lit. And we got a lesson going on, so we don't want to disturb them. Then we have Sagemont Park, which is located in the Summerlin Center Village, part of Summerlin South, and they also have two, two lighted, lighted tennis courts. courts. Hey guys, Chris Chapman, buyer's agent for the Angelo Hair Real Estate Team. Checking in from the beautiful Sagemont Park, West Summerlin, right across from downtown Summerlin and Red Rock Hotel and Casino. Got a great park here, plus two tennis courts. Sagemont has two lit courts. Hello, I want to. These are some of the most brand new courts here in Summerlin and people are on them all the time. Then Spotted Leaf Court, which is part of the Willows Village in Summerlin South, two lighted courts. Hey guys, Chris Chapman here, checking in from Spotted Leaf Park in the heart of Summerlin, checking out more tennis courts. They have two of them here and they're lit. Also park for the kids and another great soccer area. Look at those mountains behind us, pretty neat spot. So here we are inside guys, Spotted Leaf Park and Tennis Courts, two of them lit. We have some good action, the rallying here going. Then the Vistas Park, which is part of the Vistas Village in Summerlin West, and they also have two lighted tennis courts. Hey guys, reporting to you from Vistas Park, West Summerlin established, one of the biggest parks in Summerlin. Basketball courts, football field, two little league fields, of course the play area, and we're here to talk about the tennis courts. The Vistas boast two lit tennis courts. Gorgeous surrounding trees. Keeps the wind and the quiet down. Then, you know, Sun City Summerlin technically it's a Del Webb community. It's in Summerlin, but it's not part of the Summerlin Association. So I briefly just wanted to go over what Sun City Summerlin has to offer. There's a lot of courts there, so Chris is not gonna take a tour of them, but they have 10, no, they have 12 lighted courts and three locations at the Desert Vista Community Center, the Mountain Shadows Community Center, and the Pinnacle Community Center. So just, just FYI on that. So then we're gonna to go to the pickleball courts, and the first court is the Oak Leaf Park, and that's 
located in the um, Cliffs Village, part of Summerlin South, and they have four pickleball courts. Were they lighted? They are. They are lighted, okay. Hey everyone, buyer's agent Chris Chapman with the Angela Hare Real Estate Team. We are at Oak Leaf Park and checking out the pickleball courts. Keep in mind, these are not lit, but there are four of them to play on. Oak Leaf Park is another gorgeous, smaller, southwest Summerlin community park. Super cute. Lots of activities for the kids. And of course, our four pickleball courts. Then, Reverence Heights Clubhouse. So Reverence has a park, but inside the guard gated aspect, they also have pickleball courts. They have five of them and they're lighted. Beautiful clubhouse up in Reverence. I wasn't able to go in. I wanted to do a video tour of Reverence because I was making a video and they wouldn't let me in for copyright. Only if we could sneak <laughs> in, we could give you the video, but sorry, can't do that yeah. one. So then we have Stonebridge Park, which is brand new. It's newer, located in the Stonebridge Village, part of Summerlin West. And they have four, four, courts four lighted lit. courts. Perfect. Hey guys, this is a phenomenon sweeping the country. Pickleball. And I'm here at Stonebridge, very west of Summerlin, to show you these lit courts. Let's go check them out. So, as you can see, we got four lit pickleball courts. Here's Stonebridge, great view of the mountains behind it. Beautiful park. Additionally, at Stonebridge Park, we have basketball courts, picnic and grass areas, as well as shaded park for the kids. And then last, we have Sun City Summerlin, which also has 10 pickleball lighted courts in Sun City Summerlin, so that's pretty awesome. Um, so we just thought it was important so that you know what type of tennis is out there for those of you that live in Summerlin. Obviously, if you want to take part in playing in any of these courts, you do have to make a reservation with the Summerlin tennis um, community, and you also have to have a ID card saying that you live in Summerlin. Stay tuned, we will be doing a video on all the tennis courts that are surrounding the Summerlin area, not just in Summerlin. That way, if you want to take advantage and you live close to Summerlin, but you can't utilize the Summerlin tennis courts, then that's a good recommendation or video that we will have for you guys. Right, if we can't get on the Summerlin courts, a lot of us meet up at the different various courts that are in proximity to Summerlin and right. get out there and get our swings in and get our practice in. Yep. So if you have any comments or questions about all these tennis courts and pickleball courts that we went over today, leave it down in the comments below. As always, you know, we appreciate you guys watching. Make sure that you like, share, and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye.